The fire was huge and in a few hours it completely burnt down Kapalala market in Ndola. Over 3,000 stands were reduced to ashes, leaving thousands of marketeers without a source of income. This happened on 30 August this year, and two months later, the marketeers at Kapalala market are still looking for help. Luckily, the Chinese community has come to their aid. 22 Chinese-owned companies under the umbrella of the Zambia Chinese Association have raised 77,000 kwacha to help the marketeers at Kapalala market. I'm a, I'm a legged Zambia people, okay? I'm a thank you in the Zambia helper, okay? Uh, I'm very happy in the helper Zambia. Uh, 450 packages uh, for meal meal. And uh, 500, 100 loaf, it's 100 piece. Yeah. The association has handed over 450 bags of meal meal and 50,000 kwacha cash to the marketeers. 100 marketeers received 500 kwacha each to restart their businesses. Na totera sana ni mpokerele kwe impia 500 kwacha. Kwe na ubuteko butuwadi dide mweresa. Butuwadi dide, bafu nishe wana mushika. Pantu wana mushika, machiribale edida na nomba, muli file fia pia. Butuwadi dide fio muya ya no muya ya. Pantu pia fuile wa mbe shemuna mkopa beo tituwa totera mkwa ye. Copper Belt Minister Boman Lusambo, who is also Kabush Member of Parliament, was on hand to hand over the donation. The minister thanked the Chinese community for the help. The president of this country, His Excellency Edgar Chagualungu, he has taught us how to network. Whatever things which has happened today, it's a, a result of um, networking. And this is, not, this is just a starting uh, point. Uh, next week we'll be giving another 500 uh, uh, kwachas for marketeers just to contribute or to cushion on their bed. Hundreds of marketeers lined up at Masara Secondary School to collect the bags of midi meal. This, however, caused a stampede, and this woman was injured in the process. But with the help of onlookers, she walked home with a bag of midi meal, just like hundreds of other Kapalara market victims. Poshalala, Zerumbisi News in Dollar.